A supporter said, do you and L still be talking? Damo said, no. Another supporter said, why your crush liking other girls' pictures for? Damo said, I don't know who or what you're talking about. So I guess that argument after that live was very intense. If you don't know what I'm talking about, that link is popping up as well as the link is down below. Damo was on the live and Lou got into it with Lawrence and they was going back and forth. And Damo looked like she was beyond pissed. And she tried to text both of them to tell them to chill, but they just kept going and going and going. Lou actually actually did speak out the next day about this here's what he had to say so somebody asked about lawrence man ain't no problem with lawrence man i was just a little cut in there you know he took it to the heart he took it personal and we ain't need to do all that so i'm not i'm not here to argue with him hopefully he's not, he not here to argue with me i'm not saying nothing about him hopefully he don't say nothing about me keep it moving simple see a lot of people and their feelings about that there's no reason for that you know Made a little joke, he took it, I took it. Keep moving, he grown, I'm grown, we gotta handle that as grown men. I should never said what I said, we keep moving. Simple. I mean, you know, we don't gotta do all that. I, I deal with real life shit, man. Real life shit as in trying to, trying to like look out for my mans, make sure he good, trying to look out for my brother, make sure everybody good, make sure my mom is good. You know what I'm saying, I'm good, I'm good on that, you feel me? Like, <laughs> I know what I said I know the joke that I said Everybody know the joke that I said People laughed People laughed about what he said You feel me? He said some Whatever he said We keep him moving Now what I'm wondering is If Damo is still gonna come out With that song that she wrote about Lou I don't wanna be hurt man I'm so scared of love man I don't wanna feel worse So I'ma push you away I don't wanna be hurt man I'm so scared of love now I know a lot of people in the comments are gonna say L can stand for Lawrence also it does not mean that it's Lou but this is what she said the same exact day a supporter asked her you like Lawrence she responds such a good friend that's it they've always been friends and not so long ago he celebrated his birthday and this is what she had to say to him so their friendship is still intact even though it won't go beyond that don't feel too bad for Lawrence because he has moved on to another YouTube boo her name is Desiree Mitchell the question is do you want to see me again I want to see you for the rest of my life. <laughs> you are so... Yes, the same Desiree Mitchell that was working things out with Flight and possibly they could have had something going on. But after that little kiss he did with Dami yesterday, I think Desiree should just mind her business and see how things are working with Lawrence. That's just my opinion. Y'all can leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all think. And until next time, peace. Yo, ladies, I got a question. I need you to answer this to the best of your ability. If you're going out with a guy, right, and y'all both not rich, y'all both not sugar mamas and sugar daddies, should it be 50-50 or should he pay for the date? Or should y'all both whip out y'all wallets and pay for it? I why I bring this up, because some of y'all girls be thinking we we y'all daddies or some shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Y'all be thinking we y'all pops. Like, hey, pops, pay for this meal. Like, y'all be so prepared for a guy to pay for everything when I think it should be 50-50. But am I tripping or am I not? What is up?